Hey guys, my name is Kelly Cake. Welcome to my channel. So today we're going to begin Unready, my nighttime skincare routine. I changed up so much stuff, so I want to let you guys know what's tea, okay? I've been on this little natural wave, you know, just trying to try out some new things because I have honestly tried so many things. If you have been a subscriber, if you know me, you know I have problem skin. And when I tell you I've tried almost everything on the market, girl, everything on the market, okay? So the one thing that I didn't try is a natural skincare routine. And what I mean by natural is like literally cooking up the stuff like in my house, like making my own mask out of stuff in the cabinet. Um, you know, just natural, 100% organic. So yeah, during the quarantine, I took to Amazon and well, I took to Google first to research everything. But then I took to Amazon and literally ordered everything I needed. And I just basically dove into it to try to figure out what was what what do i like what makes my skin pop what makes my skin feel nice and soft what makes it glow some of the stuff isn't natural products some of it is like you know from Ulta or sephora and stuff like that so i will be able to give you guys recommendations for stores like that as well but today is really just showing you guys what i've been doing that natural tea okay so without further ado let's go ahead and get into it make sure you hit that subscribe button turn your post notifications and follow you on instagram okay because you already know when i get cute i take pics and i post them i'm also doing an instagram challenge right now posting every single day so follow me and just catch the vibe catch the look sis okay so, all right, let's go ahead and get into the video. So as you can see, your girl is beat down. Well, actually my beat has expired probably like an hour ago, but that's okay. I mean, it's still kind of cute. I could powder her down and still be out the door, but girl, it's time to take it off. So I use a oil cleanser to remove my makeup. I double cleanse. So this is the first step. This is the Dermalogica Pre-Cleanse and love this stuff. It is so bomb. It breaks down that makeup, all that gunk, girl. I'm gonna show you. How about that? All right, so I just squirt some in my hand and swoosh it around and I'll just go in, y'all. I make sure I really get it into like my lashes because y'all know I be putting on 800 pounds of mascara. So we gotta get her off. We gotta get those lashes nice and clean. And I feel like this really helps break down even like waterproof mascara because y'all know that's a tough cookie. So yeah, now that we look crazy, <laughs> I'm literally just going to rinse this off. Don't forget your neck because, you know, you got to blend that foundation down your neck. You also got to wash it off your neck. All right, so I always take a paper towel and I just make sure I get like those areas where the makeup is kind of hard to really get off. Like, you know, sometimes when you don't want to really touch your edges and stuff like that. So, ooh. Look at my neck, there's still stuff on there. Don't worry, that's why I double cleanse, like, because you can never get it all the first time. All right, so for cleansers, I have two that I really, really love, but I use one depending on, oops, sneak peek. Uh, I use one depending on like how my skin is feeling. So if my skin is feeling like crusty and just dry and flaky and gunky, I will use the Murad Hydration AHA BHA Exfoliating Cleanser. It looks like this. I spoke about this before on my channel. So to my understanding, this is a chemical as well as a physical exfoliant. So that's why I like it to get all that gunk up out of there and just have my skin feeling like extra smooth, okay? Like this makes my skin feel so good, y'all. But right now my skin isn't really feeling like that gunky. So I'm just gonna use a regular cleanser. So the one that I use is a CeraVe Renewing SA Cleanser. What? I love this stuff so much. So the reason I really love this is because it does not dry my skin out. I have tried so many cleansers that people rave about on YouTube and Instagram or whoever. It dries my skin out like most of them do. And this one doesn't. Like I was so shook. I don't remember who recommended this or when I decided to try it. But I think I was just desperate and watching like acne videos and just decided to try everything and this is the one that stood out the most okay y'all so let's talk devices i know a lot of people use devices or like seeking devices to use for their faces as far as like brushes and all that type of stuff so i actually use the foreo luna 3 this is so woo. this is really like one of those gentle but deep exfoliating cleansing devices like it really just gets that that cleanser up in there and gets all that dirt up out of there i just love how it works i've been using it for the past couple weeks and 
I love it. Every single time I use it, I'm just like, mm, give me more. So the cool thing about this, it comes with the app that you use and you basically can control it from your phone. So all you do is you kind of just like go through the registration. It'll You just basically go through the prompts when you first download it and then you register your Luna and then you get to use it. It's super easy. Press start. It's vibrating. Like it's literally vibrating right now. So yeah, I've been loving this. It gives me a really, really good clean and you literally can pair it with any cleanser you want. Like you just put your cleanser on there, suds it up a little bit and let it just do its work. So when you start it, it'll vibrate and then it pauses for a second and that means move on to the next section of your face. And I really like that it makes you take your time to clean your face because sometimes we could just throw that cleanser on there and rinse it off and feel like we're clean, but no, we need to spend time on really getting that deep clean that's what I like about this. Okay, so I don't know if y'all could tell, but do you see that glow on my skin right now? Okay, just look at my big old forehead. It is glowing. And when I tell you it's so soft and so smooth, what? And my skin does not feel dry at all. It is pretty pricey, I will say that, but I do think it's worth it. I definitely think it's an investment. So definitely check it out. Everything's down below. You're gonna literally feel like a new woman. And when you try it out, you're gonna understand what I'm talking about, okay? <laughs> okay, so let's get into these masks because this is really where I gotta like whip it up, okay? I'm literally concocting a bunch of little like, girl, it's crazy, okay? So the first one that I'm gonna show you is the one I'm gonna put on my face and then I'm gonna talk about all the other ones that I still like while I'm, you know, masking. So yeah, a little backstory on the mask that I'm about to show you now. I actually was scrolling on my Explore page and saw this girl's before and after picture of her acne journey and she looked amazing and she was using this ingredient, this powder. Never heard of it in my life. No one talks about it, okay? I bought it and I love it. So the powder that I'm talking about is 100% organic Costle face powder. I think that's how you say it. Don't, okay, don't quote me girl, but I think that's how you say it. So this is a product of Somalia and y'all know, y'all know, Somalians have this gorgeous skin. Like their women are so beautiful. Their skin is so gorgeous. And I'm like, hold on, let me see what they use because I need some of that, okay? Their skin be clear, glowing, melanin, popping, just like, ugh. And also I did more research on it and a lot of Somalians do mix a little bit of turmeric in there, so I'm gonna be using that as well. So yeah, this is the turmeric I use. It's straight from the grocery store, y'all, okay? So just go to your local grocery store, get you some turmeric, go to Beauty of the Horn, get you some Costco powder. I think that's how you say it, don't quote me, okay? And I'm gonna mix it up with a little bit of water and just put it on my face. So here's what it looks like. It looks so gross, but we're gonna put it on our skin. So I literally just take the spoon and I just spread it around. This is so freaking good. I actually was wearing this on my Instagram story and a lot of people were interested. So if you guys want little sneak peeks and stuff, girl, follow me on my Instagram because that's where all everything goes down, okay? Also be careful not to put too much turmeric because you can 100% stain your face. Like I have come out of this looking like the Jolly Green Giant and it is not cute, okay? I look radioactive. Okay, y'all, I am so upset because I forgot my key ingredient. I usually put two drops of my tea tree oil, 100% pure, okay? I usually put two drops of this. I totally forgot. I was just excited. Dang it. But this, put two drops of this in there, girl. Your skin is gonna look amazing in the morning. That's why I do this at night. I wake up feeling like new face, who this? All right, so to tone my skin, I'm gonna go ahead and use some rose water. So this is 100% pure and organic rose water. I got this from Amazon. I'll link the links to everything down below. I don't think I said that, but everything will be down below. And yeah, I just use this to kind of like restore my pH balance, get it nice, all hydrated and stuff. You know how it goes. Not gonna lie, I'll be drenching my skin because I just need all that goodness, y'all. Rose water is it. You can also use some apple cider vinegar and a water mixture to tone as well. I've used the apple cider vinegar and water mixture before, so I just wanted to try something new and I've just fallen in love with rose water. It is lit, okay? But that's just another option that you could choose. So let's go ahead and moisturize. All right, y'all, so we got another natural one and I actually use aloe vera gel. So 
This has literally changed the game for me. Changed the game. It is just, it's bomb. Like I, y'all need to try this, like period. I don't, just try it. So I just put some on a cotton round and I put it on my face. And I literally just soak my face in this stuff. And it absorbs so well. And your skin is left feeling like just, you never miss the beat. It just feels so good, like. I just love aloe vera gel. I don't think I could live without it anymore, y'all. Let me make sure I get my neck too, girl. We gotta moisturize that neck. So next on the docket is jojoba oil. So I have been loving this stuff to moisturize. My skin loves this stuff. It just drinks it up and it's just like, girl, thank you. It's what I've been needing, okay? Thank you so much. So yeah, also from Amazon. It's actually the same brand as the rose water. What's the brand name? Levin Rose, I believe. I think so, yeah. Ooh, 30% off, okay. That's what I need. When I tell you this is literally gonna last me forever because I don't use that much, I literally use like two drops and I can spread it around my whole face. This is the perfect time to really like massage your face, get all that goodness, press it into your skin. I feel like I'm getting a facial right now. Like this is so nice. So yeah, definitely don't use too much. You'll know if you use too much because your skin should absorb it. If it doesn't absorb it, then just lessen the amount that you use. I've kind of gotten my amount down pat because like I said, I've been using these products for about two months now. Okay, so after that, yes, I'm still moisturizing. <laughs> I use a cream moisturizer and I have two that I really love. So the one that I always rave about is a Drunk Elephant Proteiny Polypeptide Cream. This stuff is so good, y'all. It's pricey, but it's worth it, okay? But I wouldn't recommend like, you know, buying a full price. Girl, wait till the Sephora sale and just grab you one, test it out. I fell in love. I love it. Can't get enough. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. All right, so the next one, the one that I'm gonna use, I just found this and I've just fallen in love. I use it every single day ever since I took it out the pack, okay? I just can't get enough. So this is the Elf Happy Hydration Cream. Y'all, when I tell you dupe, okay? It is such a dupe for the Drunk Elephant one. It's crazy, it's crazy, it's crazy, it's crazy. Like Elf literally just hits the nail on the head every time. I just did a video with them, so definitely go check it out where I did my first impressions on a whole bunch of Elf products skincare makeup all that okay check it out but this right here girl when i tell you it's literally the same thing as a drunk elephant and this is like a fraction of the price so definitely go check this out it's linked in my other video but i also link it down below too see i'm just gonna massage that in it's such a rich like face cream so it's really gonna give you that like very nourished moisturized feel and just make your skin feel like velvet literally Make sure you get up under them eyes too, okay? And like I said, girl, get that neck, okay? Don't be stingy. Get that neck. All right, y'all, and that is pretty much it. That is my nighttime skincare routine. Yes, I do this every single day. Crazy, right? But yes, I do this every single night, and my skin just be feeling so good in the morning. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and go, girl. It's my bedtime. It's what time is it? It is 12.58, girl. I'm tired, but I look good. I feel refreshed. I'm gonna wake up looking like a baby's booty. And that's what's important. So I love you guys so much. Thank you guys for even requesting this video. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you guys on my next video. Peace.